A prolonged drought in Kenya is having a devastating effect on people and animals, as rivers dry up and grasslands shrivel in parched game reserves. Thousands of animals have perished from thirst, starvation, and disease due to severe drought. The arid plains are strewn with animal carcasses. Indigenous Sabru have lost all their livestock, their chief source of income. Now they must rely on aid to survive. The United Nations World Food Program has had to ramp up emergency food operations from 2.5 million to 3.8 million people in Kenya. The number of severely malnourished is also on the rise, leaving children in the northeastern town of Saburu vulnerable to illness. The WFP has called for U.S. $300 million in donations to feed hungry Kenyans for the next six months. The United Nations World Food Program has increased the amount of rations we're giving to children under five and their mothers. At this hospital, the numbers of children who are severely malnourished have increased in the past couple of months. On average, they're receiving four children per week who are severely malnourished and need to be given special care in the hospital. Three consecutive years of failed rents have caused mace shortages throughout the country. This has forced poor families to sell their belongings and reduce their food intact to one meal a day. The drought is expected to be over by the end of the month. The United Nations Food Agency, however, has warned that the onset of seasonal rains could cause flooding and mudslides. This, too, could destroy crops, killing livestock and damage infrastructure. TITV Weekly.